Pittsburgh so much. Isn't it nice? I love just coming down to the city and there's just so much concrete and cement and traffic and, and masks. masks and stuff. 5G. Mm -hmm. It's just the best. It is. It really lights up your soul. It humbles you. It does. Yeah, welcome to the humbling experience of the concrete jungle. What are you doing? Well, we're eating ice cream. Mm, we're eating it? Sucking it. Wow, <laughs> that's good. This is the first dairy milkshake I've had since 2012, probably. 2012? Yeah. Wow, you've been really missing out. I've been vegan. Not since then, but I haven't had a dairy milkshake since then. Doesn't veganism just seem so weird to you now? I mean, I still enjoy it. Like, I still enjoy vegan food. I don't know. Not for me again anymore. Like, why can't you eat cow? Like, why can't you have cow meat or milk? There's a lot of reasons. It depends on where you're sourcing your milk and all of that. Like eggs and cheese. Yeah, depends on the source. Like things that aren't really. If it's pasteurized, anymore. if it's not, there's a lot of it. A lot of things go into play there, but. This is the milkshake factory. Hello. Hello. Again. Again. And again. Where are we now? Going to Whole Foods? Yeah. Just had a fake smoothie from Milkshake Factory. I think it tastes good. Oh yeah, it definitely tastes it's good. It's not like But it's homemade, full of sugar and stuff. But. So. I'm sure their ingredients that they used was like Oreos and cookies and well, cookie dough and yes. so it probably has high fructose Can corn syrup confirm. in it. Can confirm. Keeps you humble if you eat that once or twice a year. Yeah, I'm getting blueberries. Organic blueberries. Berries are important to get organic. I don't really like strawberries much, so I'm not going to get those, even though they are on sale. Do you like strawberries? I don't usually eat a lot of strawberries. It's not my favorite. I'm trying to grow some though. I bought a strawberry, I bought, I bought strawberry seeds. I'm gonna grow my own. Whoa. Maybe they'll be different. Derp. Derp. Empty shelves, huh? What well, is this evening, so I gotta get a fresh reload. When I don't have a plan, then it doesn't go well. <laughs> How do we grocery shop without a plan? Oh. Zucchini? Yeah. I'm, I'm really tired right now. We just ate noodles and milkshakes and I haven't done that for probably, it's been over six months. So I'm really tired. I'm struggling. Wow, it's hitting me. I need a I need a coffee and a green juice. What's that? Butternut stuff. Hey, Mike. Hey, Mike. Hey, this is, what is this for? This is going to be my uh, blue light blocking shield. Perfect. So I don't have to. I forgot my glasses. They're in the car. Shoot. I'm gonna make a technology. Why would anybody want to wear this? Seriously. Is it supposed to be like that or am I wearing it wrong? <sighs> look how cute I look. <laughs> Stupid. Mine's gonna be way better than this. Farmer Mitch. All right, today we're gonna be harvesting some potatoes and uh, we're gonna get our hands in the dirt and that and pull out the taters for the season. Put them in the, the cold house to keep them cold for about a year and that. And then we're gonna sell them, okay? A pro tip is uh, we keep the dirt on them suckers. There you go. We don't wash them dirt off because dirt dirt holds it in and keeps them, keeps them good in that for a long time. Thank you, Farmer Mitch. Pro tip. What's going on? Uh, organic oats, the store brand, is $6.99. So I'm gonna buy a bunch because I'm ultimately saving money because the price is just gonna go up because we have the best president ever. Yay! Yay! <laughs> well, there's supposed to be a, an oats shortage, right? I don't know, is there? I thought so. Someone well, talked not, about that. Not in our house. We Cost got oats for shortage. us. Who's got oats? Us. What'd you just call me? I said, man, I feel like a liberal. A liberal? Why? I said, don't you feel like a liberal? Because we just got green juice and uh, some ginger shots. With hemp. They're delicious. These, okay, I gotta do a little promotion. Not sponsored, but 
these are amazing for any digestive issues. Trust me, amazing. Change, change everything. And they're in glass, which is way better. That's cool. What I was saying was... You called me liberal. I did. Because uh, we have our reusable Whole Foods bags in the back, right here, full of organic produce. He's wearing Earthrunner sandals. And he's gonna drink his screen juice and his ginger shot. So, I mean, that's what's happening right Also now. call me pro-choice. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> that's where you're going. No, <laughs> not quite. Yay, liberalism. That was fun. I saw a mask back there. Just, just Quick, we're safe in the <gasps> car. Where's the hand sanitizer? Oh my Get it. goodness. Nope. How's your ginger shot? Pinky out. Uh-huh. Oh my gosh. This is so good. I just feel really good about it because it's in a glass bottle and I just know that I'm really helping the environment because we are experiencing a global climate crisis and it's our duty as fellow people on this earth to really give back and to be as clean as possible. And this is the way to do it. As you can see, it is red. We have a uh, special red light in the room. Um, and red glasses on because we're hardcore. Yeah. Well, these are for downstairs where there's not red light. But we made it back from the democratic state of Pittsburgh. Did you have fun, truly? Yeah, I always have fun with you, babe. Aww, Aww how yeah. cute. <laughs> yeah, I think it's a, like we just said, it's a humbling experience to go to the city and then come back to the the good old country and that out in here in the boondocks. It's very nice to kind of get a new perspective and really appreciate the fresh air, the abundance of space that we have and yeah. nature. And That's everything. what I always say. Multiple times a month I go to the city and I always say like, it, it's good for you to go to see what it's at, like not around here in the small town. And now yeah. you know. Now I know. Yeah, so we got our groceries. We did. We ate some noodles. We did. We didn't share any of that, but it was great. Yeah. Noodle head. It was very interesting. Noodle head. Delicious. Nice little cozy hole in the wall. That's right. Lots of masks still out there in the world. Very Tons. surprising. Tons. I just don't get it. I don't either. What are you afraid of? I'm not afraid of that. I don't understand. Take it off. Doesn't make any sense Take at this it point. Off. Seriously. Moral of, the, moral of the video? It's Just you're take just it off. Hiding. You're hiding behind it. Take that it is off. all that's happening right now. Take it off. Get over yourself. And take it off. Yes, please. Bye! Bye. <laughs>